All right, here is another video about uh, how to change your cabin air filter. The dealer tries to charge you about $65. Uh, you can get the actual air filter for, uh, I think, seven or so. Uh, first thing you're gonna do is open your glove box. You can see this little uh, knob here. There's another one on the other side. And then there's this little, uh, not really a hinge, it's more of a stopper right on the end. So what you're gonna do is take out this little knob, you just twist it, it comes right out. Oh, don't throw it in there because it'll fall on the floor. And same thing for this little knob. You twist it and it'll pop right out. The glove box will come down a bit further and down here on this side you just pop this little plastic thing. Let me try to hold a flashlight at the same time. And what that's going to do is it's going to open up into your uh, air conditioner intake. So, I'm just going to try to balance that there. Here's how easy it is to get to your cabin air filter. You pinch together these two little ends. They just pinch together like this pinch. Uh, this whole little sheet comes out. And there's the old air filter. You just grab a hold of it and uh, pull it out. Try not to spill all the goodness. This is the old one. Pretty simple stuff. I'll set that down there. And I've got a new one right here already ready to go. You don't want to pay attention to the arrow. The airflow is going to be going down. So you want the arrow to point down. And pretty much that's the little gap you're aiming for. If you hit it right on both sides. There we go. And just slides it back in there. I'm gonna have to push on one side at the same time as I push on the other possibly. Oh, there we go. Back in there. And all you do is uh, put this back on. You put it in the little ending here. It just pops right in there. And you push this in back. Just clicks right on there. Done. You have changed your cabin filter. All right, so to put it all back together, you just reattach the little knob right there to its little counterpart. I'll see if I can do that. And these two uh, little holes, they're actually keyed, so you gotta put them in. It really, you can just turn them different ways to get them in, but uh, they should go in pretty smooth and, and pop right in place. I'm gonna try to do this while also filming. You won't be able to see too much because my hand's gonna get right in the way. There we go, you can kind of feel it pop in, and then when you turn it, it kind of latches. So do the same thing for the other side, and then you are good to go. Saved yourself $65.